Welcome back to Darkest Dungeon 2, everybody. Not the most exciting team this time around, unfortunately. We managed to grab a survivor runaway, so she's going to have a massive bonus to that cauterize, along with a couple of dodge tokens at the start of combat, which should be good. Enabling her to use fire starter, I believe, although I guess she's just getting a speed token and doesn't necessarily have plus or uh, any bonus to her base level speed, so... Second round, she's always going to be going first, which may help, may not. Night Sworn Grave Robber going to be moving around a lot with the Lunge Pirouette. And then we got a Backline Lurker Highwayman who's going to be uh, benefiting from this plus 35% damage as we activate our Infernal Flame. Let's do this. Onward. And let us hope enough yet remains of the world. Allow me to get a little uh, inside baseball here for a moment uh, for the YouTube folks. Shout out to the YouTube folks. Thanks for watching. If you're watching the VODs over on YouTube.com slash Bear Taffy. If you could click the like button for me, if you're one of those people doing that right now, that would help me out quite a bit. Because outside of the obvious, the like button, every now and then, the algorithm just decides to grab just like random episodes of this series and spit them out into people's recommended feed. And that ends up being such a tremendous help for my channel because not only does it remind people that I exist, it increases the likelihood that then, you know, other videos of that series and other videos of mine in general get recommended. It's got a massive snowball effect. So please and thank you. So just click that little button. It makes a tremendous difference. Yeah, eat every single one. The algorithm craves that thumbs up. Anyway, back to business. What's our first fight going to look like today? Even your valley is not immune to the spreading stain. See if we got the right kind of skills to deal with things here today. Howling end, always a good start here. I'm liking the speed on this team very clearly. Uh, oh, well, maybe not hers specifically. Oh, from a token. Wait. Winded gives minus three speed. Oh, I didn't even realize that. I thought that was just a... Um, a strength thing. Huh. Good to know. Let us hope to finish this quickly. So yeah, that definitely feels pretty good to begin with. I was going to say, though, yeah, I, I like that they've all got a decent amount of speed to begin with, too. Push on to the inn. Rest and resupply await you. I suppose it makes sense to do this. And then you know what? Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that too. You can have this one. You can have this one. Sure, it works. Those glimmers of light aren't going to matter here. We're going to be going with the infernal flame this time around. Let's do it. Come on, big pig to start. I know I've been getting a lot of them. The place is a little worse for wear. But <laughs> you just gotta nice. ask. Sometimes you just gotta ask for what you need. Hell, they had two of them that time around. I really wish we had an additional eight relics here. I'll take the whiskey bottle, though. Learn what can be taught. That you may stand just a little taller at the end. I feel strongly that toe-to-toe -to -toe should be our, sol our uh, option here for our first mastered skill. The ability to howling in and then immediately clear the winded token is really nice. And mindfulness, as vital to survival as sharpened steel. The stagecoach inventory upgrade right away, which is really great too. The barnacled timbers of the coastal villages are sodden with salt and secrets. I'm gonna be greedy enough to head to the shroud right away. Let's uh, let's hang on to these two, I think. Save those for in relationships are looking a little closer. And give her some bread. 
You can have some slime mold. Yeah, I guess that'll do for now. Hit it. Propriety floats listless on the tide. Brined in noxious degradation. Avoid the hospital. Which, honestly, I'm not really going to pay much attention to, considering it's only a hope benefit, so... Doesn't really matter. While there is still time. I think the odds that we end up fighting the Leviathan here are slim to none. Considering uh, how early on it is. I've yet to even get any trinket help, no mastered skills, and that guy is certainly no pushover still. We've had some decent teams going up against him uh, lately, and I've, I've felt a lot more confident about it, but a squad like this... I don't know. I feel like I feel like this is a weaker team. A place of research and inquiry. A monument to a once prestigious career. I guess we're about to find out, huh? <laughs> we'll see if that YouTube spiel was worth going on for a run that's about to end in 15 minutes. Elite Shambler. The walker from beyond the stars. Wow. A shambling horror. That is uh that's bad. Jesus Christ, the extra resistance too, of course, from the Inferno Flame. Okay, boy, oh boy. We're in trouble. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Let's see here. 23% chance to crit the lunge seems pretty good. Take a shot on that and then I like take aim here to give us a crit on the shambler. Let's do it. Howling end. Decent start, quarter of the way there. No dodge, that's unfortunate. Alright, we're gonna pirouette here, no doubt. And smoke screen, which is still a pretty decent option. Blinding the shambler helps a lot. We'll pirouette. Pirouette plus grape shot is probably gonna help us a lot for this fight. Nice dodge. Nice. Really helpful. Let's still add the combo to him for some reason. We'll take the double kill. <coughs> double kill right there. And then we're going to have to toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Hellion here to clear that winded token. Nice stress heal. Well done. Shaggy Jacko with the prime sub. 60 months on the pile. Welcome back. Get him a few bear hugs, please, if you don't mind. Thank you very much for the resubscription. Combo will daze him, I think, or maybe not. Another Howling End, followed up by a toe-to-toe. -to -toe. I'm loving that combo already. Another Daze there. We'll probably just uh, Fire Starter, I guess. Maybe Fire Starter the... Yeah, I like this. Fire Starter for the Grape Shot Blast. That'll help quite a bit. yourself. How can you tell it's an Elite Shambler? Up, up here in the corner, Elite Enemies. This is going fairly well. We're going to be able to pirouette here again. Oh, just kidding. That's not up yet, but... Three dodge tokens and the speed. Smoke screen again. I'm getting to see where we can potentially be limited here. Still think that's a pretty damn good idea, even if they don't burn. Here's the ordained spawn here, too. That kind of sucks. I didn't realize that was a thing that could happen. All right, this is becoming a little problematic. Steady yourself. I don't have Rockus Revelry equipped here either. That might be an issue. She is not able to do anything besides move forward. I suppose neutralizing powders was a good way to go. If only I had known. She might have to go ahead and equip Ransack as well just to be able to move forward. No luck on the dodge there, unfortunately. I think Pirouette's up now. Pretty nice shot there. I don't have point blank equipped, sadly, but I do have toe to toe. I can take aim up front in order to set that up. Okay. Suppose we're just smoke screening again, really. I can't even do that. Jesus Christ, she needs another move in the back for sure. I'm realizing that now, big time. The one dodge at least. Oh boy, that's that's a bad shuffle. That's a meltdown too. Yikes. 
Not great. Ooh, Martyr, though. Okay, that's something out of that, at least. Small benefit. Crit self-heal, too. That'll help out. All right, so the Highwayman's probably just going to have to move back here, unfortunately. I guess I might as well do that, considering you're apparently able to burn from something. Fire starter on somebody? I don't know. I feel like I should still just try to blind this guy. This is really unfortunate, but I feel like that's got to be the way we go. She is in trouble. Nice dodge there, at least. Get a blind on him. Oh, God. Yikes. She's going to need an absinthe there, absolutely. Howling End is tempting, but she is weakened here, I guess. Gonna heal for a little bit off that one, get the taunts back up. She's absolutely gonna have to absent this. Thankfully, we can start cauterizing now that they're bleeding. Self-reliance is a rare and wonderful thing. That's pretty helpful. She should have her pirouette available next round as well. Ooh, the amateur weaponsmith with the crit. That was timely. Oh, that's still on cooldown? Well, that's still pretty good at least, I guess. Weakened, but worth it. No blight. Yikes. Unfortunate. I don't think she needs a heal. She's going to be able to heal herself off this next attack. A little bleed, not too bad. Here comes the Howling End. Good damage. She's got to heal herself for sure. Don't want her falling. There goes the bleed. She's feeling okay. Grape shot crit here certainly seems like a good way to go. That's going to be eight damage, bringing him to death's door. Okay. We're surviving. Still up. Still kicking. Nice dodge from the grave robber, too. Speaking of which, hell yes. You got this. You got this, little lady. Stay alive. Self-reliance is a rare and wonderful thing. That's the clapper claw dodge. Oh, yikes. Might have to go for another cauterize there. That's probably the play, yeah. All right, let's see. You just got to try the pistol shot, I guess. That'll do it. Let's go. Huge. We get one more heal off the toe toe, clear the winded. Keep the taunts up, keep everybody up and healthy. Sweat soaked brows, unsteady stances. There we go. Exhaustion takes hold. Heal up, get the cloak, looking good. In fact, that'll set up a really powerful pirouette next turn. Oof. They are not stopping though. I think we're gonna have to go for another adrenaline rush, Jesus. One more cauterize. Get the grape shot blast here. Might actually kill this guy. Nice. Straightforward. And effective. Yeah, she's gonna have to do this one more time. That's just too risky, especially with the taunt up. Alright. I think she's good. Got it sorted. Really, that's a lot weaker than I thought it would be. I guess it is weakened and blocked. So despite all that, it's still pretty decent. Yeah, she's really got to have Ransack. We have to swap something out for that. Maybe the Dragonfly. She's just really not effective from the back in her current situation. Take heart Survived it. And do not relent. Good lord, that was a test. Amidst the spoils, an artifact of unparalleled power. Wow. 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 I can't think of any other words. Oh my god, that's an that is an amazing trinket. Immediately equip that on the Hellion. The loathing abates. Extremely good. Ooh, yeah, worth it by a mile. I'll do that again every single time. An elementary problem. 
Is it not? A couple of skill changes here real quick. Let's go from Iron Swan to Rockus Revelry, and we're going to go ahead and swap Dragonfly for Ransack. Trog Archer! 28 months. Welcome back. Thanks for the resubscription. Appreciate it. Oh, I just realized I triggered the meltdown there. That was real silly. I should have paid attention to where she wanted to go. Damn it. Oh, well. Okay. Got to work on our relationships here. Not too surprising, I guess, if we're going to start out with a Shambler fight that everybody's going to get a little stressed out. Ah, oh, two more negative pips, huh? I guess the loathing isn't that high. Let's just do this. Oh, boy. I mean, I really don't want to be passing on fights right now. A few more bear hugs, please, if you got them. Thanks for the 28 months, truck. Appreciate it. All right. Here we go. A little scary, a little spooky. Just gonna start with Pyromania too, huh? Which means preventing the raucous revelry for a turn, unfortunately. Let's begin with a lunge. Take you out to lunge. Oh God, all right. Thankfully, no negative relationships yet. It could be worse, I guess. Could be worse. At least there's time to fix them, right? Yeah, we're pretty early on here, so it's not the worst thing in the world. Speaking of which... Unfortunately, that does prohibit her from uh, doing a taunt this turn as well. Has been tended to. Hopefully, she'll be able to act quickly. I like smoke screen here still. It's pretty good. We'll probably upgrade that pretty quickly, I'd imagine. Especially because we have a lot of benefit from combo on this team. Bear optimal. Let this set up the toe to toe pretty well, though done deal Messy, but effective. all right let's see i guess they don't really deal a lot of stress damage these guys do they but i'm very excited to see the effects of that trinket when we get into like a cultist fight or something like that that is gonna be a lot of fun you need to just crit heal yourself or something how about we go ahead and uh let's do this there we go worth it she still definitely needs to do a revelry even though it's unlikely that they give her any stress go ahead and bring her to full oh i guess she was gonna heal off the revelry though huh i didn't even think about that oh well so to tell probably kill this guy her taunts back up maybe need another revelry by the end of this fight another crit my god she is feasting, but sadly missed that one. Oh my goodness. Well, seems like a bit of a waste to go for him, right? But I guess it is going to prevent his attacks, so worth it. No, we can't revelry again, though, this turn, because she's on cooldown. And apparently they do have a stress attack. That's good to know. Might even have one more cooldown of revelry, unfortunately. Oh, he's stealth too. Fuck. He boned us. I can't kill this guy. He fucking got me, dude. God damn it. Well, at least we get to do that. Better than nothing. Maybe we'll get like a miracle grape shot blast for 14 damage. Literally impossible, but for some reason it happens today. What matters most is we reach the mountain. Alive, if possible. Alright then. That'll work. I'm trying to come up with a segue to talk about this, so I'm just gonna start talking about it apropos of nothing. Must be silent. Ooh, hey, there we go. We'll take that. Thank you very much. 
huge benefit. So I uh, got some lunch the other day. Went to good old Chick-fil-A. And uh, had my second encounter with a person uh, that I can only describe as way too friendly. Do you know how when you go to Chick-fil-A, like they've already got kind of that, like that, that, that false air of, oh, it is my privilege to, to service you. You, you, you've humbled me with your choice to partake of our fast food this fine day. This girl, bless her heart, clearly just trying to do her, her job as best she can. Well, first of all, does something that I, I feel like, despite the establishment, no, no matter where you go, just is a weird feeling. When I was driving up, not quite to the window yet, but was like maybe 10, 15 feet away, she leaned out of the window and shouted, Hi, Alex! Which, you know, she gathered that from my order. But it's just it's a little off-putting, you know? Like, I know you know my name, but I don't want all the other cars around here to know my name. And I know it doesn't matter. But I'm not trying to be friends with them, you know what I'm saying? Or you, really? No offense? I just want my chicken. I just want... I just came here to buy a chicken sandwich that makes me feel bad for buying a chicken sandwich, okay? That's the whole point of going to Chick-fil-A is to get a tasty sandwich that you know comes at the cost of the well-being of hundreds of thousands of people. That's why I'm here. I didn't come here to make friends with you. But thank you for being nice. But then when you get to the window, she starts to talk in this voice that is just not her voice. Eager to ply his trade. It was like if I talked to you like this. Like if I, oh, we're so, we're so happy to be here today. And be infantilized. Infantilized. Just talk to me. Just, you can be nice. You can be nice without putting on hairs like that. You know, honestly, I think it has like the opposite of the intended effect. When you do that. Queen of Sprinkles. Hi. Thanks for the 54 months. Welcome back with Bear Pile. Appreciate it. Boom. Well done. I work retail. False positivity helps keep me legit positive, convincing myself I'm doing okay, and I get rewarded for it. Good. Glad to hear it. But like you just said, yeah, I think you can go overboard with it. You can give me, give me a little much. You do what you gotta do, man. I got, I got all the... I'll say empathy, because I think I've, I've worked enough of these jobs to feel like I can... I can exhibit empathy for it. I know it ain't fun. Okay, she just got a crit off that stress attack, by the way, so that's already the best trinket ever made in the game. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. False positivity is better than the fuck off attitude you get in France. <laughs> okay, yeah, I suppose. I suppose I would prefer feeling like they actually want me there as opposed to the polar opposite. In crisis, Fair enough. We can rely only upon each other. There's just certainly a threshold for it, man. There's a, there's a point that you can take it where you have where you have crossed the line of its effectiveness and now begun to revert back in the other direction. I think she might die. I was worried about this. I guess it's time to toe-to-toe, -to -toe, right? Even though this feels like a waste. 
Really, I love a revelry there, but we gotta get the taunts up. Gotta find a way to get her stress heal leveled up there, too, as soon as we can. Get her a little further out of harm's way. Added another bleed, unfortunately. That sucks. I suppose it's uh, slightly possible, maybe. Oh, does not does the upgraded version of Tracking Shot ignore slash remove stealth? It does, doesn't it? Ooh, boy. Yeah, sometimes I'm looking for that too, Mr. Me, not you. I'm being real. Ah, we don't have a way to attack him, man. God damn it. Okay. Son of a bitch. We're rolling the dice on a bleed here. I don't think there's anything else we can do. Bear lock. Bear lock. Okay. Woo. Woo. Boy, a little scary, a little scary. Nine zero. Oh, Wayne, Wayne's a staple, Daniel, no doubt. Yeah, he, he remains one of my favorite parts of the entire series. Good old Wayne June. Devil girl, burning brightly. What are you doing? World to see. What are you doing? What you think? Looking at me like I got something for you. What's up? You're so cute. You got your tail wagon. Sweet babe. Sweet babe. Look at this high definition camera. So focused. What's up? What are you doing? You're so cute. Nice! The rousing recorder, I'll take that. No paparazzi? Ah, very good. Oh, I completely forgot I got this trinket, by the way. Jesus Christ, plus 22 max HP. Don't mind if I do. Give her a few extra hit points. And there you go, there you go. And then let's just do that. Sure, yeah, that works. Cool. Burn salves to you. That's probably worth keeping. Sweet. Off to the watchtower. So no, isn't really going to do us a lot of good here, but I mostly took it because it was the stress heal for everybody. And then the lair is coming up. The value of such a view is matched only by its unsettling awfulness. I don't even know if I should consider it, to be honest with you. I'm better off going with that easy path, especially because at least it should be. They don't want to go. They would much rather not, so I'm with them. Have you ever had a random IRL fan encounter? I've had a couple. One when uh, it was a PAX several years ago. I went to a sushi place and uh, the Lyft driver for one of the people that I was meeting for lunch their Lyft driver recognized me, but I wasn't in the car with them. I was already at the restaurant. So when they got to the restaurant, I had to come out to the front of the restaurant so I could meet this guy who knew me, who was their Lyft driver. So that was a fun interaction. And then uh, there was also a time when we were uh, parasailing. The one time in my life that I've gone parasailing and we were sitting on the boat just chatting with the uh, the parasailing guide or whatever you call him. And we got to talking about Twitch. And the guy goes, do you guys know Northern Lion? I watch his stuff all the time. I was like, I'm, I'm a little familiar, yeah. <laughs> you ever, do you ever watch the NLSS? He's like, yeah, I love the NLSS. Oh, I'm... I'm one, of, I'm one of those one of those guys that's on there sometimes. I'm Bear Taffy. What? And he just freaked the fuck out. Cause I, I don't sound exactly the same in person. I, I, I the the microphone uh, enhances a lot of the 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 more vocally enticing parts of my voice to describe it as poorly as I possibly can. The flame, 
burning brightly for all the world to see. So yeah, that was that was a pretty hilarious encounter too. I don't need that. But I will take that. And get rid of that, because I know I don't need it. Bear sounds like a chipmunk IRL confirmed. Yeah, I didn't want to say it, but... I'll, tur I'll turn off the voice amplifiers I have activated here. This is my real voice. Hi, guys. This is how I sound when you, when you approach me in person. This is my normal voice. I know it's a little off-putting, but... You get used to it after a little while. <laughs> I like I like putting on airs with this voice though. It's more fun. I'd really love it if you didn't have a meltdown. I know it's a little much to ask. That's good. Hey, Peter. Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Nice. Another dodge from the recorder. Hell yeah. Come on, one more dodge. One more big dodge here. Nice. Huge place from the runaway. Love to see it. That's the lunge finish. Amidst the spoils. Oh, baby. An artifact of unparalleled power. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Put that on the Hellion. Jeez, I need more Hellion trinket slots. Let's go, dude. Oh, man. I like having plus 22 max HP on you, though. Plus 22%, I mean. Uh, I guess you're using melee skills. That's pretty good. Not incredibly often, but... Yeah, okay. Well, lunge. Lunge ignoring death's door seems pretty good. Let's do that. And then pirouette is uh, pirouette's ranged. Ah, that would be best on Hellion for sure. But I guess I could use the max HP benefit on either the grave robber or the runaway too. You know what? Let's do that. That seems better. You do this, and then you do this, and then this, and then this. There we go. They prostrated themselves before the primogenial power of the obelisks. Oh, did they? And were rewarded for their supplication. Pig! Hell yeah. Guarding gauntlets as well. I'll take that. Slight upgrade. Healing cell for later and a noisemaker. Nice. Looking good, dude. How broken slash fun would an encounter that rewarded an extra trinket slot for a character be? That would probably be pretty OP. That seems like it would be incredibly strong. I don't know if they'd be able to balance that very well. Well, there goes the meltdown. Not a lot to do about that. Oh, that's a bad one, too. Yikes. Oh, no. This is a problem. Souls hey, Matt. Thrive in chaos. They Hawaii. Grieve. Hey, welcome. Each covets I'm thinking about going there soon, actually. And plots to take it. It's a beautiful place. Another crit from Rousing Recorder. Love to see it. On to the next. Uh, I kind of want to give you your upgraded run and hide, too. I don't know, though. Let's go with the smoke screen for now. No blind, damn. It's fucking gorgeous. Yeah. 
I went, uh... I think when I was like 15 or 16 or something like that for a family trip. It was beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Combo Ransack. Do, 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 do. There's the stress hit, which means free crit for her yet again. Two make that. Yep, that's per each individual point of stress, apparently. There's another one. There's another strength token. Gonna need a revelry here for sure, though, unfortunately. Probably want to upgrade that skill soon, too, just to be safe. Uh, let's just go ahead and do a pistol shot, I guess. Sure. That was a lunge look. Pretty good. Pretty good. Two dead. Clear a corpse. Heal it up. Heals can crit, so why can't stress heals? I'm kind of with you on that, to be honest. I would not mind seeing that as a future feature. Feature future. Crit heal. Oh, that sucks. With that at least, though. Smoke screen. But that would imply you can get critically stressed, too. I guess... It doesn't have to, right? Collaboration confers advantage. You can just not work like that. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Do 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 dazed. By which I mean dead. An unexpected find. Restorative herbs, nice. The game is about being punishing. I suppose it is, isn't it? So if they found a new opportunity to punish you, why would they ever squander it? I don't need that trinket. Pleasure Viking. Thanks for the five months. Welcome back into the bear pile. Appreciate it. No goddamn way. I mean, fuck it, right? <laughs> <laughs> Might as well. <laughs> souls thrive in chaos they create. Oh my god, this is so stupid. Hey, it's not an elite at least. Walker from beyond the stars. A shambling horror. Mallman rebooted. Three months, welcome back. A howdy to you. Another negative relationship, Pip. That's definitely what we needed. Come on, burn. All right, there we go. An unavoidable end. That will get us started. And some neutralizing powders. Give him a nice big whack. We're going to get a whole mess of positive tokens from this, at least. Ah, minimum hits all across the board, though, unfortunately. All kinds of tokens. It's firebomb. That's terrible. Okay. If we take aim for a crit rape shot here. Since we should be pirouetting. Let's see. Fire starter. No, I think I like a smoke screen on this one. Because debuff resist is fairly low at least, so that's nice. Yeah. I think we got a toe-to-toe -to -toe here to add more taunt. Well, actually, I think I'll do a revelry here and then do the taunt since we already have one up. Nothing yet, Maul Man. No, I haven't heard anything yet about the new character. Crit off the rousing recorder. That's pretty nice. Unfortunate timing considering that's likely to be eaten up by the double winded toe to toe, but I'll take it, I guess. That should be another uh, positive token. Nice. All right. Not too bad. Pirouette's still pretty effective here. These dudes have their block tokens now, though. This guy's got his big damage buff as well. Another crit there. That's pretty good. Plus 100% damage in the back. Jesus. 
And the fast attack from the Shambler, too. Shit. That sucks. Let's see what we can do back here. I think I should just go ahead and focus on this guy. Cauterize is probably wise here. Who's your guess for the next character? I'm really hoping it's someone brand new. I would very much like to see someone we haven't seen at all yet in the Darkest Dungeon world. But if I had to guess from the existing characters, I'd say... Arbalist. Because we've been talking about the need for some backline damage quite a bit. And that would fit that role nicely. That seems smart. Extra crit chance. No blight, sadly. Cauterize again? That's probably wise. A calculated generosity. But a welcome one nonetheless. I honestly think I just need to kind of accept that we're going to be dealing with a lot of stress and maybe even another couple of meltdowns here. Another crit. That's going to be a strength and crit howling in there. That is going to be sensational. Speaking of crits. Very nice. The stress heal there is going to help a lot. 32 damage. Huge. Not to mention the combo. Steady yourself. There's another crit. I right, just gotta find a way to hit him with some DOT or something. Tumultuous vulnerable. Steady Ouch. That's gonna be the meltdown, alright. Yeah, thankfully it doesn't really matter too much here. That is, of course, more stress added on, but thankfully another token as a result of that. Dodge from the Rousing Recorder helps a lot. I like this. Another impediment cleared with impunity. I like that a lot more. Let's try for the burn here, I think. Random adjacent monster burns when target comboed. Oh, that seems like the way to go. And then I think we can still toe to toe from spot three for her? Yes. There's a waste of a crit, though, but I don't think it really matters, actually. Nice. That helps a lot. Let's clear the corpse. Let the Hellion actually hit this thing. Huge. Wow. Okay. Good job, team. Shit. That went a lot better than I thought it would. The past is gone. Let it die. Plus 22% damage trinket. Wow. That is kind of cool. Huh. All right. Let's give that damage trinket to the highway, man. That seems like a good idea. He needs the help. Added death's door resist. Who's got the, they've all got 69 first of all, so that's a nice to that. Let's do this. So She'll be at plus 30%, which is basically max. It means you can't change it. It did kind of feel like that. I want the hero shrine here. I want to take the easy road for sure. Yeah, let's just hug the right. We need to do a lot of work on these relationships. Honestly, feels like it might just be a better idea to get all the way to the negative relationship for the rest of them. Who will face the half-remembered horrors of their past? Because that'll mean it'll take less pips to get them out of it and then back down to, like, normal territory. Especially if they're already, like, really close, which I'm pretty sure they are. Eh, they're not that bad, actually. Yeah, you know, we're probably better off just not trying to do that. Even though it might happen without us even trying. Oh, yep, there we go. Speaking of which... There's another one. Womp womp. Oh well. That's what I was planning on doing anyway, so... I can accept that. 
Do you think we need another healer character? I know Arbalist has a heal in the original. That's kind of why I thought she would fit the open role so perfectly is because she, you know, has everything that we're looking for in a new character with the uh, small heal, backline damage, another backline option for our builds. She really checks a lot of boxes in that regard. Lunge might just kill this fucking thing. Nice. On to the next. Oop. Uh, nine stress. That's gonna need a rocket revelry, I think. Anxiety forms insidious fears. Then again, I can probably howling in and just murder somebody right now. Uh, let's see. Let's just do this. You're stunned. Hell, I might just wicked hack this guy to death. Nah, let's do Hell again. Okay. Blinded. Didn't matter. We're probably going to need a revelry followed up with a cauterize here. Uh, let's do this. Might even upgrade this tracking shot to deal with some of these stealth enemies. Oh my god. Did he just gain stress from attacking? He's a pacifist, right? That's why. God damn it. He is Death Secret now, though, so I guess that's nice at least. Cool. No need to revelry anymore. There you go. And the pirouette! The slow suffering begins. And a tiny bleed, not too bad. No dodge either, damn. She doesn't need the heal, though. She'll be good. She's a big girl. She can take it. Booyah. A petty hindrance. Mastery? An inkling of potency still right. lingers in some of these well-worn relics. 5% chance to gain stun. No thank you. Abates. No thank you. I'm good. Alright, just an assistance encounter. Then our guardian. We got six mastery points out of this place. I think that'll do for me. Not gonna push for many more. Do, 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 do. I was thinking about the marks, since only the Arbalist enemy has used them. But the bounty hunter used combo to deal extra damage. Yeah, I think the marking system has more or less been replaced by combo in this game. Oh, man. I think we just need to leave this, actually. I don't know where Runaway Highwayman is at right now, but I'm pretty sure I should just bail, unfortunately. It's not confirmed that Arbalist will be next. No, we're just speculating what it would be like with her in the mix. I have no idea what the next one's going to be. I think we got a decent amount of food, actually. The relics are looking pretty good, too. We got several relics from this region. Emptiness and dissolution have wormed their way into the world. Supposedly, it's the bounty hunter. I wouldn't mind that. That'd be a good inclusion. I think I'll just ransack him to death. That would take away my pirouette, but... Oh, wait, never mind. No, it doesn't. A promising development. Worth. Nice. Yeah, if we could get both Bounty Hunter and Arbalist, I feel like, yeah, we could absolutely uh, make some good combination plays and compositions out of those two together. That'd be sick. Even out that damage there. Very nice. I'm actually feeling like we could probably handle the full uh, Guardian fight here. We're in pretty good shape all of a sudden, and, you know, relationships can't get much worse, so I might as well try to make it a little better, I guess. Yeah, fuck it. Do, 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 do. That trinket that gives us the positive tokens on stress hits has already proven to be extremely beneficial, too. That's so good. I'm loving it. 
messy. But effective. I think I'm actually just gonna clear the corpse here to set up a better pirouette for next turn. Definitely want to upgrade that to be a stress heal soon. The Leviathan's breath thickens the air. Ah, that's an unfortunate blind. Yeah, it still worked, okay. They falter, so press your advance. I'm starting to like this team a lot. The work continues. It's working pretty well. Damage is decent. Got some good damage over time too. All their tokens and whatnot. Feeling pretty good. Boop, 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 boop. Aside from wanting good team comps, I think Bounty Hunter would look awesome in the new art style. Oh, very good point, actually. Yeah, that's a that's a good reason to want to see him, too. And to see all his unique animations for his skills and everything. Yeah, that'd be awesome. That is also an exciting prospect. Do, 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 do. Clear the dodge. Take him out. Very nice. Probably pop another revelry here. Clear the dodge again. I almost want to have Firefly equipped still on the runaway. So she can do like ransacking the Firefly and be shuffling around like that. That'd probably be pretty effective for her too, I bet. We gotta upgrade this highway robbery too so we can start stealing those tokens. Do, 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 do. Oh sure, yeah, and finding about or finding out about his backstory from the hero shrines. I, I forgot that was even a thing. It's been so long since we did that ourselves. Nice crit. Terrific. A little stress there, that's not too bad. Apparently it didn't matter at all. Here, what I think actually is better here than trying to clear a corpse, although I guess if that's our only option, I'll take it. Now, time for the revelry. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Colorai, sure, why not? Play it safe, buddy. Play it safe. Give the speed buff to the uh, Hellion, too, which actually, now that I realize. I probably should have gone ahead and tried to clear the corpse to give her a howling end shot next turn, but... Oh, there we go. Thanks! Oh, never mind. She's dealing one damage. Winded and weakened. I guess that would do it. Grape shot. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely excited for the uh, addition of some new characters, Huffy. I'm, I'm feeling... Feeling like things are getting a little tiny bit stale with the uh, selection we've got now. Ooh, cool. Wow, phenomenal trinket for the Plague Doctor. But otherwise also pretty goddamn good. This is really nice. Takes away debuff completely, but adds a significant chance to your uh, DOT. I'll go for that. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely ready for the inclusion of some new characters. It's just going to make things so much more interesting. Even, even just one new hero is going to mix things up so much. Smoke screen. Doo -doo -doo. Clear the dodge. Nice. Let's go for a tracking shot from the Cherub. Maybe set up an Iron Swan. Nice miss. That is huge for us. Resisted that too, hell yeah. Good taunt. Pirouette may not be the play here. Now it is. It wasn't before, especially now. Good lord. Do, 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 do. There you go. Mmm. Hey, nice resistances. God damn, that's been really good. Ow. Dodge there, though. Got the burn at least. Okay, that's going to be a daze on her, though. Grape shot's pretty solid. 
Hmm. I think we go for her. Beautiful. Yeah, he's gonna get worshipped. That's okay. The slow suffering begins. Oh boy. Hmm. I guess we could do that on her. It's not a bad idea. I feel like I just gotta try to kill this thing though. There we go. A petty hindrance. All right, now we can daze the cherub, which is really not gonna do a lot either, but that's okay. I'll test ya! Thank you for the 20 months! Get a few bear hugs in there, please. Welcome back. Thank you very much for the prime. Appreciate it. We're gonna need to cauterize real bad here. She tried to stun her, good lord. Relax. There we go. Alright, he's dead next turn. He will get his worship off if I let him, though. Which it looks like I'm probably just gonna have to let him. Based on our current circumstance. Oh, man. Not looking great. Yeah, he's probably gonna get rid of that DOT, unfortunately. It did, did tick down a bit. Oh boy, and yeah, that's a lot of stress. Okay. As expected. Narrowed eyes, muttered threats. Yeah, it has gotten to the point where it's actually kind of uh kind of beneficial for us to just go ahead and welcome the negative relationships at this point. Like it really just changes it. Yeah, exactly. It changes it from having to fix uh, six pips to having to fix four, which just ultimately ends up being better. So yeah, we're fine. This is completely acceptable. No blind there. That kind of sucks. He might even have another meltdown here too, unfortunately. Well done. Instead, he got a crit. I'm fine with that. Yeah, that works. No more burn there. We get a little blight at least, though. I think I have a taunt up. I'm pretty sure I have a taunt up. Yeah, we're good. She's going crazy with the pyromania now, too, though. Hey, shoes. Welcome. Yet another meltdown. She can't bear another moment, she says. Oh, we got Death Seeker, though. We have two Death Seekers now. That's pretty fun. Yep, naturally. Okay. Thankfully, we get to cauterize here. That's convenient. Dragged back from the brink. Welcome, oh, shoes. Good to see you. Hey, that's huge. That is a really big help, especially right at the end of this one. That is really nice. Can we deal three damage to get him to death's door right now? We sure fucking can. Goodbye, big boy. We are out of here. Let's go. Yet another mastery point. Bunch of relics. And a fun, unforgettable trinket. Neat. Worth it. Gotta equip some stuff. Clear this. I don't want that. I don't want that either. Plus 20% traveling heal. Nice. I didn't even notice we had that. Yeah, they need all the pigs. No doubt. All right, good enough. That works. Let's hit the end. Hell, we're even going to get this hope benefit, aren't we? The loathing festers. Hope indeed restored. Good first region. Good stuff. Rest now for a time. Lazy Eye, Phantom of Mania, Doomsayer, Martyr. 
shroud tactician and nervous. That's a lot of quirks. That's a lot of quirks, y'all. Been busy. Man, lazy eye really sucks for the highwayman. Big pig! Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. We'll go with the songbook of rousing tunes, the whiskey bottle, the meditative totem. Gonna use a couple of these right away. There we go. What's the in boon? Plus 100% academic studies location scouting. Let's see if we can give the runaway highwayman some help. There we go. And then let's see if we can remove that lazy eye quirk. Get rid of pacifist. Oh, that was nice. He's feeling a lot better all of a sudden. Huh. That's an interesting one. One learns quickly when survival demands it. Okay. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. And then everything else is kind of similar. Maybe the revelry upgrade. And then smoke screen's really good. Yeah, that was a, a very eventful first region for sure. Let's do tracking shot as well. And then uh, howling end is usually a really good upgrade. Firestarter wouldn't be bad either. Ransack actually with the pole too could be helpful. Poison Dart is also always a good choice. Let's take Poison Dart. Let's get more Blight involved here. The next stop is leagues away. Plan accordingly. No need for the Hoarder Signal Decoder. Rain, fire, and rot. Is there no sanctuary from this madness? Minus 20% consumable item and trinket prices is pretty nice. Maybe I go sprawl. I usually should just take the sluice though. Gotta get those mastery points. Take the songbook, take the herbs. I'll take some smoke bombs too, actually. Those are always pretty good. Alright, cool. Let's give him some food. Oh, I had better food to give her. Whoops. Well, there you go. There you go. And here, have some cheese. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. There you are, buddy. Let's get going. So far, so good. Hopefully the sluice provides some benefits. Tread carefully and quickly. This is swine country, by the way. Tread carefully and quickly. This is swine country. Creature dead. Gotta reduce this loathing too, dude. It's getting up there. Do they not hate each other now? Well, unfortunately, we didn't really find a lot of ways to improve that, but we did make a lot of progress with it. Oh, well, there you go. Speaking of which, tumultuous cleared. Just like that. Oh, and here we go. Benefits for everybody. Sick. That's a huge token buff early on, too. Okay. Let's do this. Lunge start. Let's just kill this fucker. Ooh, and then we're going to go for the... Uh, the tracking shot on the spider in the back. No more dodge for you, buddy. Highway robbery was pretty tempting there, but with the combo especially, it feels like a good way to go. 47 damage, by the way. I think that might be enough. Haste and carelessness. All right. 
hallmarks of the unprepared. Fair enough. Oof. Oh, and the blind, too. Yikes. And another crit. Good lord. Let's see here. Ransack? Sure. Woohoo! Big damage. Pistol shot coming. Go for the blind shot. Why not? Ah, okay, okay. Worth an attempt, I think. Ah, boy. Well, she can stress heal here at least. Worth it. Get that stealth up. Dodge it. Nice. Toe to toe. We'll just pirouette to get her the heck out of here. Or maybe not. Crit self heal, sure, fuck it. Back to full, no stress. Ah, uh, well. She just transferred it, I guess. Oh, no, there it is. She found it. She found a way. Oh, the upgraded pistol shot would have been a good call, actually, too. I didn't even think about that. The combo stun on that is really good. All right. Wave two. Perfect opportunity to use caltrips here. Glad we held on to those. Looking good. And let's do that. Fantastic. Oh, perfect. She goes first. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. And there goes all those tokens. And let's go ahead and keep the Hellion up front here. We can rely only upon each other. I got a howling end that ought to do basically all the work we need here. Nice burn on that one. Oh, I forgot we had a pirouette coming. That was a waste of a howling end there. Oh, well. Yep. Nice. Elementary. They have been wiping the floor with this creature den so far. This team has made this look easy. Not a problem, dude. Tanky Hellion leading the way up front. Go ahead and heal her to full for fun. This wound at least has been tended to. Pop another pistol shot in the back. Minimum damage, not too bad though. Toe to toe, yeah. Make sure we keep our taunts up. He's not too much of a threat anyway. He's blinded, shouldn't be too bad. Mm-hmm. Lunge? Sure. Why not? Do I still have Iron Swan equipped? I think I do. Which, obviously not going to work anymore having cleared the corpse there, but oh well. Steady yourself. Oh, that's a big blight. Wow. Yikes. Ooh, I might have to go for an adrenaline rush here, especially with double blind. Uh, well, let's do that at least, or try. Okay. Keep on shooting, buddy. There we go. Great shot. All right, let's just kill this dude. That'll work. I don't have Iron Swan equipped. Okay. We are the flame, burning brightly for all the world to see. Not the greatest reward from there, but the discount on all combat items usually helps out a lot. Not bad, I guess. At least they're loathing too. Up ahead, a seat of our <laughs> regrettable research. For a minute, anyway. Now it's back. Yeah, Skeever. Hail enemies, Skeever too. Yikes. Dodge. Oh, the opposite. I did not realize you had 47 HP. Holy shit. How do you have so much? Oh, it's the hail draft. That's why. That's why. That ah, shit. Hey, Ethereal doing great. That was a wonderful day today. Lots of fun on stream. All right, got a taunt here for sure. Just right there. There's your target, buddy. Don't use the cripple them. You just want to use your single target move that hits her 
Please, for the love of God. Thank you. Steady yourself. That's fine. I mean, you do that all you want. That's acceptable. More than acceptable, in fact. Welcome. Pure wet fire starter seems like a good call. Hit it. A slow dissection. Perfect. An unavoidable end. That's a lot of damage, but she can take it. So this, she's looking for that damage in fact she welcomes it she craves it methodical appliance of harm but she is gonna need maybe a little tiny bit of healing maybe a little raucous revelry before this one all wraps up she does have speed so she should be able to do it sick i love the contrast between this game's atmosphere and barren breakfast yeah i know i, I was excited for the juxtaposition of those two games today certainly providing different experiences but i'm enjoying both the work continues all right we are the flame burning brightly for all the world to see yeah loot's been a little lackluster so far in the sluice oh well Come on, guys. Well, at least they get a little relationship work done. Ooh. Wow, look at that. Fix the relationship. One away from fixing the Hellion Grave Robber now, too. This has been worth it for that alone. Ooh. Oh, okay. That's really good, though. Hellion Runaway is actually on the way to a positive now. Hey, you're back. Let's just see if I can just murder this dude. Close to it. Oh. Burn? Oh, he's pyromaniac. Or she's pyromaniac, right? I forgot. Maybe we'll go tracking shot on that guy. Try to lunge, see if we get lucky. Nice. This is what the tourists have to go through before getting to the places you build in Baron Breakfast. What if this eventually becomes one of the places we can build in Baron Breakfast? What if those creepy, ominous undertones we've been detecting the entire time are not misleading? And they're, in fact, representative of what we should expect moving forward. Messy, but effective. Um... I guess... Yeah, let's just do this. Uh, that's good news to me, J. Sweet. Love to hear that. Maybe just the game looks really, really good, because the game does look really, really good. Always does. Toe to toe. Off you go. Ooh, got the combo too, nice. With the combo. Ba boom. Boom, boom, boom. Shake the room. Sweet. Mastery, 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 mastery. Oh. Man. The loot has not been kind in this sluice. I'm not really getting a lot of good stuff. Okay, so what was the relationship we need one more to fix? Hellion Grave Robber. Let's see if I can get that. Nah, no luck. They do all want to leave, though. So I guess we will. So be it. The Dumpyard Hamster is actually Wayne June after surviving this game's apocalypse. It's the crossover we didn't know we needed, but at this point we can't not have. At least in our head cannon, anyway. Boop, 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 boop. Let's just take the easy one, I guess. Works for me. Ooh, free crit, nice. Gimme that! Those are my dodges! 
totally my dodge now. Dodge. Nice. Uh, still toe toe, I guess. The real question is which animal would have Wayne's voice? Who's the guy that we just met? The Mastiff? Because it's got to be him, right? Got to be him. I want to say Jax. Oh, the turkey, maybe. Yeah, the turkey that runs the uh, the little mini mart. That would be good, too. I don't remember his name either, though. Is his name Ipswich? What a strange name. We are the flame, burning brightly for all the world to see. More garbage loot, dude. Oof. Your name's Ipswich, Jackson? Oh, no, Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> hey, maybe your name's Hip Switch too. That'd be interesting. The fire is lit. The table is set. The Yo! Awaits its favorite guest. Bloodthirsty, yes, sir. Nice. Come here, a Stewie. Runaway is gonna be hitting hard. Let's go. Big pig. Let's go! While the heart still beats, desire will never die. Man, these two have really been through the ringer already, huh? My God. From tumultuous to amorous. Love to see it. And everybody's balanced out in the middle now, too. Fantastic. Conventional fare. Whiskey barrel. But fairly priced. Dartboard. Very nice. Looking good, dude. I'll pick up the holy beads too, and then Something maybe the, to ease the, rigors of the road. restorative herbs. I'll get a couple of the cheeses. Learn what can be taught, that you may stand just a little taller at the end. I feel like there was one particular upgrade that I wanted. Oh, pistol shot, that was the one. With the stun on combo. The provinces and cantrips of our land, crumbling. And I'm done. Gotta be the fatter. Eh, not bad. Let's go with Highwayman Runaway. Nice. Alright, there you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. And we'll hang on to the rest. Let's do this. Well, hold on. Let's get some combat items, maybe. Take a fire grenade and then that's probably good. That'll work. Off we go. Typical love story, right? Yeah, exactly. Hey there, Nex. Uh, the most significant update in the last few months would probably be the trinkets update, which reworked like basically every trinket in the game. Crop grows unchecked and abhorrent. And then, of course, the uh, new area, if you haven't seen it yet, the Shroud, which is fantastic. Features a new mini-boss, the Leviathan, which is a really good fight. Might have to fight the Harvest Child here. I'm thinking about it. Could go Oasis, too, though, is the thing. And then we could hit that Field Hospital and maybe get rid of some of these negative quirks. Let's do that instead. We'll save the boss for the last region. Which is usually the best way to do it anyway. That's good to hear, Name. Yeah, no, I, I honestly, I was probably more disappointed than maybe any of you guys were in the fact that I didn't get back into, into the breach because for the first, like, 90 minutes of getting back into that game, I was, like, feeling it. I was like, yeah, this is great. I don't know why I bounced off this so quickly. But then it was after that, uh, uh, honeymoon phase ended again where I began to realize oh this is why I don't like this game because it is it really is a puzzle game like if I saw it as that or as what it is which is a puzzle game initially I think I would be a lot less surprised to find that I uh, didn't enjoy it as much 
Those kinds of experiences really aren't just for, or just aren't for me, unfortunately. 25 damage and the stun. Wow. This is no time to falter. Doo -doo. Oh yeah, they find love on the battlefield in the big way. Yeah, relationships play a huge role here in DD2. Yeah, I guess so. It feels like kind of a waste, though. Let's not even do that. Let's just do something like this, I guess. Collaboration confers advantage. That feels worth it, though, just to get the taunt up. Fire starter. A master stroke. Crit burn. Beautiful. Maybe just take him out. Two round kill on those two guys is insane. This team is starting to really pop off. Cut down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. It's a game that really punishes the hell out of you for early mistakes. Into the breach, right? Yeah, and I, I was I was really feeling that. Like, it got so frustrating to that early on in the experience get to the point where I was like, I'm just screwed. And I'm probably there's probably a way to get out of this that I'm not seeing, but I'm not seeing it. It just got more and more upsetting. So yeah. I'm, at this point, I've realized when to, you know, just take my lumps and accept that I'm not going to enjoy something too much. Move on to the next thing. Certainly see the appeal for those that are into it, though. In crisis, no gains insignificant. Huge find there. Always love to have some mineral spring water for the final fight. Doesn't help that the starter army always has felt the least fun, least interesting group to play with. Yeah, I, I man, I wish I had like, because I didn't even really see anything new, right? Really, all, all we really did was end up starting a brand new run of vanilla into the breach. So ultimately, I didn't end up seeing any of the advanced edition stuff anyway. And I wish I had. But undertakes it nonetheless. All right, so we already got rid of both of our negative quirks on the highwayman, so he's looking good. Doomsayer is probably worth getting rid of. That one feels like it's always pretty bad. Nervous kind of sucks. I think I'm going to get... Oh, that is plus one speed, I guess. 10% chance to gain stress, though. That's pretty bad. We'll go ahead and get rid of that, too. We need not be defined by our shortcomings. And there's some laudanum. Just a little bit of laudanum. One restorative herb. And there's a good use of our relics. Nice. Might as well equip the fire grenade. Yeah, we'll use the rest of that stuff, I suppose. This is a good set of final combat items. If I can grab another healing salve, I wouldn't feel too bad about rocking double lot in the mineral spring water and healing salve into the final fight. Oh, I forgot I have smoke bombs, too. I think I'll use these instead of the linens, probably. Actually, I do like having smoke bombs for the final cultist fights too so maybe we can hang on to those for that especially because we have some extra inventory slots this time oh whoops darn it that didn't even occur to me i straight up ignored that plague eaters feeding on the tainted crop that's all right though sadly a negative pit between those two but they can afford it Stealthy. Extra damage lunge. Nice hit. Let's see here. Fire grenade looks pretty damn good. An unavoidable end. Two stress healed from that move. Very nice. And let's go smoke screen here. There we go. Good dodge. All right. Could stun here too, actually. That's not a bad idea. All right, good stuff. Great start. One shot is probably not gonna happen there. Plus that's, uh, this sets up a pretty damn nice pirouette for next turn and I'd much rather have the taunts up in that right now anyway. 
Do 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 do. Speed will allow us to fire starter on the pirouette as well. Quite good. That sucks. Thankfully, didn't blind her. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. This is where we wish we had Iron Swan still, I guess. That's still fine. This dude is going to burn to death. That's pretty incredible. Quick little dodge for her, and then big shot. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Very nice. The stress heal, too. Love it. The smallest variable Goodbye. can make all the difference. Sadly can't get the last little stress heal off on her. That'd be nice. Eh, maybe we can stall this out, though. Although he's going to burn to death, right? Yeah, so I guess there's nothing we can do. All right. See ya. Messy. Effective. Man, we are in cr incredible shape right now. Another mastery point, cow trips, a sharpness charm. Then it might actually be worth it to just slap that on the highwayman right now. The loathing spreads. Because he's rocking. Oh, he's got the rousing recorder, which we could swap that for the heat shield easily. There we go. Yeah, that feels pretty good. Throw some cow trips on you. Loving it. Okay. Let's take an easier path if we can. Although I would not mind hitting that study. It's not the worst idea to go by another hospital and get a couple more restorative herbs, maybe. Come on, come on, come on. Turn the hard right. God damn it. It's impossible sometimes. Man, not the right relationship interactions here either, shit. Man, I really don't want to do that. I think I need to, though. That's unfortunate. I want to reduce the loathing here. This is an easy fight, thankfully. Big lunge. Small lunge, miniature lunge. Bravo! Might as well get that going. Let's go with the smoke screen on the big boy for the pistol shot stun. And the double blind with the vulnerable. Dodge it. Oh. Ah, that pull forward's pretty shitty. Thankfully resisted that move. Okay, not too bad. Here we go. That does make the pirouette a little more awkward, I guess. It's still definitely worth it to do it in that circumstance. Pistol shot. 10 to 21 on a pistol shot is really goddamn good. Oh, fire starter there would be so helpful, though. All right. Oh, I didn't even think about that. That was kind of silly, I guess. The lunge it is again. That certainly worked pretty well. He's not going to move off that, so I think I'll just wicked hack here. Okay. So many shuffles. Pull forward, pull forward. There we go. Thank you. And then grape shot. Nah, eh, I don't think I need to. On to the next. Pirouette's still likely to do the job here. Nice. Trivial worryment. One HP. Honestly, I think I want to stall this. Literally just to heal one stress on this grave robber. Which is ridiculous, admittedly. But I'm going to do it. I'm going to fucking do it. You're going to watch. You're going to watch me do it. That's right. I'm going to sit and watch patiently. As I shoot corpses and take aim. Or maybe not shoot cor corpses, actually, because I need the corpse left over for her to heal from. But just for that. For that alone and nothing more. I'm going to stall this out. Tracking shot of corpse, absolutely. She's dazed. It doesn't even matter. I'm still stalled. She's going to bleed to death. Son of a bitch. It's not even going to matter. It's not, I'm not even going to be able to do it. You watch that for nothing. 
was completely unnecessary. Wasted everyone's time. In crisis, no gains insignificant. Okay, thank you, Wayne. I was feeling a little down on myself, but that that Wayner made it all better. Howls. It was all worthwhile, apparently. Plus two stress on the Hellion, ultimately, yeah. Add one more for good measure. Oh well. I'm doing on relics now. 28? That's not bad. Probably still worth hitting a hospital with that amount. Another positive pip. Nice. Kind of late with the watchtower, but I'll take it. Hero shrine into hospital and academic study. Don't mind if I do. Yes, please. Give me that. Voracious and decadent, the landowners and peasants alike descended into an orgy of consumption. Hey there, Stellion. Doing pretty damn good. Having a solid run here. Fun day on stream. A little barren breakfast this morning went well, and now we're just cruising through to another W. Easily. Two shamblers in our wake. With a team that honestly I didn't even think was gonna do very think well. Carefully. Today's oversight is tomorrow's regret. Starting up with these guys, I was feeling like they were gonna be a little weak, but uh not the case at all. If you hope to heal, you have chosen wisely. Not the most exciting team either. Maybe that why maybe that was where my pessimism came from. Not the most exciting path choices or quirks to begin with with these guys, but they've gotten a lot more interesting as we've gone, I guess. Especially with the trinkets we've managed to snag. These have gotten a little more exciting. I'm just gonna get two herbs. Call it good. Off to the study. Double, double frenzied ghoul. Fun, okay. Sounds like fun. Eep. The slow suffering begins. Oh, I really wish I had equipped the laudanum. Oh, good God. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's terrible. I mean, it's going to be good for her. Everybody else, it is truly awful. A slow dissection. Oh, boy. An unavoidable end. How stressful indeed. I'll take those. I'll get us that little bit of stress. I'll take a revelry to... Eh, I'll wait on that. I'll get the taunt up for the... For the rend. Do, do, do. Burn, please. Never mind. How about some more blight? Nope. Alright. They don't give a shit about the taunt either, apparently. Okay. That sucks. How's this look? Pretty good. Combo off that. Nice. Alright. There we go. Yet another token. Holy shit. All right, very good stun. Blight will bring him to death's door. Let's do this. Maybe stun him soon. I guess can't gain dodge. Doesn't really matter for him, does it? Good fucking lord, dude. Oh, so much for our good relationships. The runaway, the only one that didn't need the stress heal, the one getting it. Meltdown probably incoming. God damn. Maybe I can stress heal her this way, luckily. Nope. Oh, fuck. Oh, okay. That helps. Delay it at least a little bit. Stunned grave robber. Stunned ghoul down on death's door now, at least. Okay. Resisted the weaken, though. She gets first action. 
It's clear that winded, one dead. Thankfully, not a time fight. We got a revelry coming up next turn here, too, and we can also stress heal her. Oh, my God. Fuck you. Jesus. What a mess this is. Double damage combo. Got the burn to land, thankfully. Let's just do this, I guess. That's going to help a little bit. Oh, okay, I guess. I guess so. That's not horrible. Well done. That helps, okay. We get another revelry here, right? There we go. Keeping everybody in check. It's not good, but it's not terrible. Smoke screen time for sure. And the combo will set up the stun from the Highwayman pistol shot. Kablam! No stun! Oof. That sucks. Go ahead and kneel yourself up real quick. Okay, please be kind. Please be kind. Please be kind. Thank you. That's very kind. Speed token again for her up front. I'll take this for an additional DOT, perhaps. Nope, never mind. Uh, just shoot him. 21, nice. All right, here we go. That was tough, but we got it. We're going to need a lot of stress healing help, though. That's not good. Another minor sharpness charm. Okay. That's probably just garbage, honestly. Yeah, that fight fucking sucks. Thankfully, no meltdowns. Yeah, that could have gone a lot worse, I guess. Oh, two healing salves. That is huge. Big find. Okay, just one more of those guys, and then we will be basically all set for endgame combat items. This seems best. Sadly, those two need to work on their relationship quite a bit. Ooh, nice stress heal there. While in the sprawl, plus 15% damage. Maybe that'll help. We do have one more region left, and it might be the sprawl, so... That'd be sick, but otherwise... Kind of meh. God, I hate when that happens, when I try to hang a hard right to hit a pile and then miss that, and then another one shows up on the left just out of my range of being able to hit it. Another positive token for these guys. Okay, I'll take it. Doo 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 doo. Oh, fuck. Good lord, that sucks. That's a good start, at least. Okay, that'll make me feel a little better. We can ransack to set up the highwayman a little better, too, actually, so that's not bad. Nearly kill this dude. Toe-to-toe -to -toe might actually do it. There we go. All right, not too bad. That worked out pretty well. I think I'll go for the take aim here. Keep him stealthed. And we'll definitely do a revelry next turn on the Hellion. Smoke screen for sure. Man, the upgraded smoke screen with this guy is so good. It's so effective. Holy shit, that was a one shot. 100 to zero with the stun is unreal. Resistance will overcome even the greatest of threats. I did completely forget to revelry there, but that's okay. <laughs> Still doing pretty damn good. The loathing whispers. Get rid of that. Get rid of the holy water. I'm gonna get rid of eight baubles too, to be honest. I definitely don't need two hundred fucking baubles right now. Problem. Is it not? They all wanna go combat, so be it. Yeah, it's unfortunate that we missed those hospitals right after. Right before getting the worries. But whatever. I 
I think we're going to be able to manage this. It's nice, at least. This is really good. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go. While the heart still beats, Run away getting around. Desire will never die. Okay. Love it, love it, love it. Let's see. A oh, lunge start, no doubt. No doubt. Goodbye. One dead. Let's make it two. Booyah Kasha. Huge heal. Don't mind if I do. Another vulnerable token on the boy. He's in bad shape. He's gonna hit that though, okay. Still actually might be worth it to go for a revelry here, despite the fact that she's not at the threshold. 13 to 27. Good fucking lord, that pistol shot has really gotten good. Do, do, do. Ah, uh, jeez. Just do that, I guess. Do, 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 do. Pirouette will clear both of those more than likely. Minimum hit there. Okay. Not what I was expecting. I think Howling End's still going to be more damage. I guess it's not up, though. All right. We'll just Grape Shot him. Good enough. The hey, Ramlatch. Going pretty damn well. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that actually worked out pretty good. Get, get around the threshold for the heal. Perfect. Totally scripted. And kill it. Beautiful. Cut down nice. Nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. All right, equip the scrap grenade, toss the baubles. The Mastery point investors. acquired. Let's do this. Let's do this. And that's probably good, I guess. Don't need those. Don't need that. Don't need that. Off we go. Nearly through region three. Actually got a decent amount of relics again here, too. Really hope we find a use for these baubles at some point, but I doubt it. Doo -doo. Not going to save the grenades. All right. Yeah, I did say I was going to do that, didn't I? I forgot about that. Indeed. Might push, might push for this guardian fight too. Not sure. Usually ends up being worthwhile. Our stress is pretty high right now, though. Might not be worth it. A couple of ordained. Ooh. Not great. All right. If they get the hellion stress up over five, probably likely to hop another revelry here. Although, honestly, doing it now seems like it might be worthwhile. Especially since, since she is uh, out of position now. Yeah, let's just pop one, sure. Oh, shit. Well, never mind. Is it worth it for two? It might still be worth it for two, honestly, but I can kill him with a toe-to-toe, -to -toe, so let's just do that. Early results are encouraging. Mm, pistol shot. He has not been getting great hits, but at least his minimum hit is still very effective. I think I can lunge again. Yep, there we go. Fantastic. And we'll give this a howling end. Actually, you know what? Do the revelry. Take the two. Especially because I got taunt up. Fodder token on the goat. This means they can be consumed by other plague eaters. He's food is what he is. Can't you tell? Based on the... Bulbous growths and tentacles. It looks delicious. 
Nice stress healing. Very good. Combo action. A little blind on the boy out of help. Oh, okay. Okay. Big shot from the Grape Shot Blast. Let's do a uh, quick adrenaline rush here just to get her in better shape for the next round. Seems wise. There is comfort in company. He's a little laudanum here too. There we go. Good shit. Another impediment cleared with impunity. Go ahead, advance. Why not? Get some more relics too. Probably worth it. Minimum hit. I like take aim here. Probably smoke screen this guy. Hellingen might be able to kill this dude. No, oh, probably not now though. Keep using the laudanum here. Okay, sure everybody's feeling real good. And we'll toe to toe this, I guess. And pirouette's looking fine next turn. Here comes the smoke screen. Nice double blind. Love to see it. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. That's going to get us up above the raucous revelry threshold again. She's immobilized. Don't have to worry about that. Be a crit heal. I don't know if I necessarily want that. Got two crits on the highwayman now. He's going to do insane damage. In fact, I think he's about to 100 to 0 this thing again. Yep. A brilliant conclusion. Absolutely. There's the stun. Here comes the pirouette. Nice little heal off that, too. I'll take it. Got the burn on one. Not too bad. Um, you know what? I'm going to do it. Worth it, in my opinion. This thing's going to burn to death. Anxiety forms insidious fears. Oh, boy. Yet more stress. Stun here, and then... What do you got? Dodge? Nice. Okay. One more burn here ought to do it. Ah, oh, damn. Minimum hit. All right, just finish them both. There we go. No more chances taken. Toe-to-toe to -toe back. No, heart attacks have been replaced with meltdowns in this game. Which bring you down to like 10% HP or something and um, have a severe negative impact on all your relationships with all your other teammates. Why did I not just try to kill him? That was kind of silly. I guess I wanted to crit him to death. I don't think she needs to heal here. I guess I could stress heal here too, yeah. Seems worth it. Just pistol shot him just in case he lives. There we go. Oh boy. The idle thought. That would be an interesting one. I'll snag it. Why not? Get a scrap grenade to use here too. This might help out a lot. Yeah, I missed that too, Daniel. They've actually made mention of that in a recent post. Red Hook has that they recognize that... Uh, the virtue chance check is like one of the it's one of the more noteworthy and uh you know like core experiences from the base game that's missing in the sequel i'm expecting we'll probably uh slow dissection an unavoidable it's something like it at some point before the game is fully finished or something that's meant to serve the same purpose more or less nice dodge there slash miss yeah so emotionally compelling sure those moments were really fun and like i said like kind of a critical part of the dd1 experience were those virtue checks we had so many uh instances in the uh the very first campaign where like a clutch virtue check was the difference between failure and success and those are always super fun to experience I'm 
I'm gonna handle these cherubs here. I guess I could try to pull one forward. That wouldn't be the worst idea in the world. Yeah, that's pretty good. He's probably gonna move back, though, is the thing. What's the most impactful thing to a successful run? Hero path, relationships, trinkets. I think paths... I mean, obviously all of the above, right? That's the cop-out answer, but... I think path selection plays a pretty large role along with just general party composition. Getting a good path uh, can be make or break on some runs. Just having a character that just like plays a vital role like the Vanguard Man-at-Arms, for example, or even before that, the Bulwark Man-at-Arms or whatever it was that it was called before it got nerfed. I should have expected that. Yeah, pretty much, Jaka. Or sorry, no, actually, uh, I misread that. What it is is uh, you select a chapter at the beginning, you take your team, you just try to get all through through all four regions uh, in a single run with that team and beat the end boss of that chapter, but the teams don't carry over between chapters, at least they don't yet. I don't know if that's the plan eventually, but at the moment, uh, there doesn't appear to be any carryover between chapters. Lots of vulnerable from this bloodthirsty. Yeah, no stun that time. Okay, at least he's double blinded here. That's gonna be another worship, but not really a big deal. Let's clear this winded. Still got another weekend, unfortunately. There he goes. There he goes. Can make all the difference. All right, just need a new combo to go for the stun again. Just kidding. That's on cooldown. This ordained guy is really tough to deal with. He's double blinded though, so hopefully that works. Nice. It's a dodge plus, though. Jesus. Let's not worry about her stress heal. I think she'll be stress healed by the time we get to the end. A couple of crits. Hopefully get a new combo from the smoke screen next turn on the runaway. Eh, fuck it. Just shoot him. It's still pretty goddamn good. Strength token there. Nice. Get the increased crit chance here, which is probably our best bet, although the lunge is actually the better way to go, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Is it? I don't think so. Stupendous. Yeah, it definitely felt better. Miss it. Oh. No time to falter. Hey, free crit, though. I'll take it. Lethality writ large. Nice. A little stress seal there, too, at the end. All right, come on, buddy. Pistol shot for the win. Two crits. And he still stays up. Thankfully, the burn should finish him. Jesus, he was resilient, though. All right, we got it. A little fire grenade and incendiary cocktail. So I am almost certainly not going to use that dark impulse trinket. Loathing abates. Nor do we even have a Dark Impulse to use it with. So we'll probably just go ahead and throw that one out. Yeah, let's just get rid of that. Especially because I need the space. I think I'm going to get rid of this medicinal herb as well. And some baubles. There we go. 224 baubles. Somehow I have 68 relics again, which is pretty sick, considering how many we spent on this region. I think that's 70. Gotta find a way to get rid of these worries eventually. Of course, we gotta find a trophy in this next region still, too. Hoping for the sprawl. So we got that uh, stagecoach upgrade for it. We'll see.
The place is a little worse for wear, but familiar nonetheless. Plus 20% damage to Cosmic until next in. Interesting. Consider your position. There it is. And plan accordingly. Let's take that upgrade. Oh, I need to use stuff first. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. Yeah, I'm really not finding anything to spend these baubles on, unfortunately. So honestly, I might just get rid of a bunch. Let's go with this. How's the relationships looking? Uh, we should probably try this on Highwayman Grave Robber. It's kind of risky, though. I think I'd rather try something else on them. Let's go with a Hellion Highwayman here. Nice. And let's see here. We need some food. There we go. One learns quickly when survival demands it. Searing strikes pretty good. Ransack. Fire starter probably works pretty well. I think lunge is probably worth it now. Oh, pirouette too, actually. Uh, there we go. Pretty solid. Regrettably necessary acquisition. Okay. Let's see here. I'm just going to use some of these. Here, you have that. Oh, you have that. You have this. You have this. You have this. And that. There we go. Okay. That works. Probably just gonna start dumping bobbles soon. This really feels like it's not worth it hanging on to those things anymore. Behold. The great cities of man. Ruined and a flame. I don't think it's really worth it to go to the hoarder. Not that I really want the watchtower, but the hoarder is less appealing. Oh, but we could have spent baubles at the hoarder, probably. I didn't think about that. Yeah, that might have been worth it. Eh, whatever. This will help at least. Do have a hospital coming up. That's nice. And an oasis at the end. Hell yeah. That ought to help a bunch. I trust you have calculated your odds carefully. This will not be easy. So we're going to have to replace something with Iron Swan here. Of course. Probably Wicked Hack. And then what else do we need to do here? I think that's about it. Probably swap Absinthe for, like, Throne Dagger, but it doesn't really matter. I think I'd rather keep Absinthe, actually. Yep, looking good. Let's do it. Do, 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 do. The library burns. And with it, the remains of philosophy. That is an unfortunate reason. shuffle. And insight. Okay. I think I'm probably just going to use that laudanum early and often here. Their burn chance is actually fairly good. Good for me, anyway. Nice stress heal. Fuck yeah. All right. Free crit. Thanks. I'll take it. How about some highway robbery? Steal them block plus tokens. And that's another free token for her. Just kidding. No stress from that. Uh, let's see here. I like ransack on you. Do, 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 do. 
Ooh, that might have just killed him by itself. Ne nearly did it. A lesson taught is a lesson learned. And she stress heals from that attack. Goddamn. I feel like this dude might not actually even be able to do anything from that spot. Certainly not when he's dead. Crit for 22. Holy hell. Iron Swan the corpse for fun. Just to rub it in. Oh, she gained stress from that, though. God damn it. All right. Whatever. Moving on. Frenzy. Oh, boy. Well, Dead of Night can actually still be useful in the lair here, though, because for the two setup fights, she can get some stress healing and normal healing from that. So not necessarily ideal to get rid of that either. I like this start here, certainly, even though the resistance makes that a lot less effective. More taunts up at least. Not gonna be able to burn these guys very well, so I think it's all about the smoke screen here. That's a nice stress heal. Speaking of which, let's go for that. We'll take aim, clear that blind, and make sure we got a more effective turn for him coming up. This one's gonna take a little longer, though. Much more involved fight here. Round two is looking real good, though. Especially with a couple of speed tokens. Let's go with another Laudanum. Maybe a smoke screen again. No, let's go with a Ransack, actually, right there. And then we're just going to Howling in that guy. Pretty sure he doesn't go first. God damn, that'll work. Nice stun. Maybe lunge him, too, actually. I'm pretty sure we'll get the kill before he explodes, though. Nice. Yeah, we got it. Hellion's coming up. Doo -doo 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 -doo. See you. Let us hope to finish this quickly. Yeah, this highwayman is doing insane damage. It's pretty fun. I'm not used to him hitting so hard. I'm loving this trinket on the Hellion, man. It has been an incredible boon for this entire run. So, so good. Just as good as I expected it to be. Pirouette coming up. Immobilized Pirouette at that. A little dodge plus. Let's have another toe-to-toe uh, -to -toe here, I think. Seems good. Crit for eight. God damn, okay. I'll take it. Stress heal too. Why not? Another laudanum, sure. Down to zero. Cauterize? I love it. Looking good. Hey, Bozzy. Slow suffering begins. Geez, so many great tokens from that. It's been a, an incredible trinket. That's a lot of burn, though. This grave robber's in kind of bad shape. That'll fucking work. A simple variable. Easily resolved. We gotta stall this so she can get a quick little grave rob <laughs> done. <laughs> Just rob a grave real quick. You know how she is. Make damn sure she's staying blinded. That's my corpse. You stole it. Give it back. Big heal. Big heal coming. There it is. All fixed. Might even try to sneak in another cauterize here. I think I will. Can't absent, so might as well just do that. Yeah, let's... 
Get a cheeky little cauterize in there. Excellent. I believe Howling ends off cooldown here, too. Should be able to bring it to death's door at the very least. Very nice. Although I guess Toto Toe would have done it too well enough. Staying alive is her ladyship. Thank goodness. There we go. One less obstacle in our path. Didn't get the good trophy, unfortunately. Charred Litany. For our runaway. That's always a fun one. I think this might have gotten nerfed. Oh, look at this. Fun combo for the runaway. Cuts the debuff of this in half. That ought to help a lot. That's probably pretty solid. It's the probably going to be pretty damn good. Be the librarian must be destroyed. Immediately starting with a crit blight. That is sensational. We're going to get a strengthened iron swan here as well. His burn resist is through the roof, so there's no point in doing the firebomb here. A master stroke. Double crit to begin the fight. Fan fucking tastic. Let's go fire starter. I don't know why I did that, just remembering what I just said about the librarian not being able to be burned, but still going to do it anyway, apparently. Another strength token. That could be bad. Okay, that's not too bad. Yeah, this is a nice one, Grave Robber. Uh, I wish I had those linens still. Let's, uh, let's do a tracking shot here. Oh, yeah, that's going to be great on this guy. You can no longer gain dodge. Oh, that is fucking huge. Can't smoke screen him, so I think I'll probably just go ahead and ransack this. Get things going a little faster there. We're going to have to toe-to-toe -to -toe one of the stacks, which really doesn't really matter that much anyway. Oh, we pulled this forward. That's kind of weird. I didn't even think about that. Oh, that sucks. Oops. Oh, well. Noted. Bear noted for next time I decide that Ransack is a good choice here. There's another positive token. Yep, right on cue. There's yet another one. <laughs> That's so good. You want another one? Yeah, here you go. I have two crits. Why not? Because you deserve it. Do, do, do. Let's see. I think I still do this anyway. Man, this poison dart has actually been quite a bit of our damage so far. Yeah, fuck it. <laughs> Just for fun, let's just... <laughs> Never get to burn any of your books. Man, this is really working out, dude. Right, yeah, as long as we can shuffle this properly, he'll never actually get his big hit off, huh? Which is kind of funny. It's actually working pretty well. Crit heal, giant stress heal. Keep it going. He's almost dead. Nearly there, dude. Ah, fuck it. So we just all on the Highwayman Grave Robber here, though. Which, unfortunately, he kind of fucked with. That's door, though. All right, we can toe-to-toe. -to -toe. That was lucky. Oh, there's his dodge back again, right? Yeah. Do, do, do. He is actually going to destroy this this time. Nope, never mind. He's dead. 
Well, that went well. Cut down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. Sweet. Let's equip some new trinkets for the runaway. The loathing festers. She's going to lose 22% max HP, unfortunately, and somebody else has to equip the recorder, but definitely want to do these. That sounds like fun for her. Let's give you this, and then... Honestly, let's just do this. I don't think I'm even going to bother with this trinket. Get rid of this thing. 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 We're saving the smoke bombs if we can, but I'll just go ahead and equip those for now just to make room. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of some baubles at this point. And those ones. There we go. Good enough. Lots of baubles, yeah. An unusually high Head. amount. A bestial refuge. Littered with bones and less identifiable remains. We're gonna do a quick check of our relationships prior to this creature den. Just curious where things are at with that. Hellion's pretty close on a couple. Highwayman Grave Robber is right on the cusp of a negative relationship, so we want to try to avoid that at all costs. I'm gonna take this. I think that's our best bet. Well, I want to make sure I do this creature den too. It's worth the mastery points. I want to be fully mastered in this squad for sure. Oh boy. Named foe. I like a firebomb here. Get started on one of these guys and then let's... It's toe to toe, I guess. We'll probably go with a highway robbery on him. That's a big hit. Go for it. Looks pretty good. Doo, doo, doo. Nine to 24. Woo, that'll fucking do it. That's a meal for him, though, unfortunately. These guys are hitting real hard now. Ah, yikes. Yourself. All right, that, was, that wasn't too bad. That can usually be a lot worse. Yep. Munch it up, buddy. All right. Do you think? Almost certainly going to highway robbery that. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Because then we got a pirouette set up really nicely with the grave robber here. Huge hit. Burn might do it. Hellion's got the wicked hack slash howling and ready to go. Nice. Let's smoke screen on Gander here. Oh, never mind. We got the crit. Ah, let's save the crit. Oh, wait, right. Yeah, it's going to crit the smoke screen. I always forget that. Such a weird interaction. That must increase the debuff chance. Otherwise, I don't know why they would do it. Blinded. Doesn't matter for that, I guess, but she's going to get at least a uh, positive token out of it. She can go, go ahead and do a quick little raucous revelry here. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Why do all of your attacks seem to burn the enemy? It might be because I have this pyromaniac. Oh, never mind. She's not a pyromaniac anymore. She replaced that with melophobic and occultomania. It was because she was pyromaniac, but now it's probably because of Firestarter, if anything. Because my attacks spit hot fire. Yeah, there you go. Also that. No need to stress heal. Poor buddy. Highway robbery, the front line, right? I think so, but I'd probably better just do this anyway. Yo, British Brad, thank you for the raid. Welcome, everybody. Good to have you. Thanks for the support. Appreciate it. Hope your stream was good. What were you playing today? 
All them tasty tokens, dude. DD2, nice. Hope the run was good. So many crits from that, dude. That's been insane. I love it. Yeah, why not? That's a good choice. Cauterize, maybe? Yeah, let's do it. Just be safe. Clear the side the fastest you ever have. Hell yeah. Well done. Grape shot to clear those. Good howling end coming up next turn, hopefully. Pirouette, too. Come on, 50% chance. Let's get lucky here. Oh, jeez. All right, that's fine. This run's going phenomenally well. This is, uh... Things are just getting better and better around here, man. Things are going real good in these runs lately. This is a team, as I was mentioning, I really didn't even feel that confident about these guys, but they are coming together in a big way. I am loving it. That's another highway robbery, although I guess it's on cooldown, so never mind. Yeah, he's gotten kind of slow, hasn't he? I gotta remember I've got that significant upgrade to uh, my burn damage done from the runaway now, too. I gotta try to take advantage of that. Let's go for the toe-to-toe -to -toe here on the non-weakened one, if possible. There it is. Oh, he's probably gonna munch up that corpse. I didn't even think about that. He didn't even think about it unless I can get the grave shot kill. Oh, Tarantism replaced the worries, which is definitely better. That's nice. If I don't end up getting to the hospital, at least I've got that going for me now. That's really, really good. No need to stress heal, so let's just try for a blight. Ooh, she's hurting. Let's go for an adrenaline rush. Although she might not be at the threshold. Yeah, she, she's not quite there. Show paths, please? Yeah, sure. Right after this fight, I will. Still no need to stress heal. Ransack for the W. Actually, let's cauterize real quick just to be safe. Especially because I can probably adrenaline rush after this fight. Or not after this fight, after this round. Especially if it gets down to her uh, turn to tick down the D DOT again. Take away your dodge. There we go, nice. Fix her up. Although I guess ultimately it's not really going to be any different, is it? Yeah. <laughs> now that I think about it. Bit of a waste of time again, but that's okay. Made me feel better. Okay, got the discount on combat and in items again, I guess. Really not that great of a creature den reward, unfortunately. The loathing of base. Especially because we just got to dump this. I'm probably just going to dump this too, to be honest. I don't think I'm going to benefit from that at all. We got two Wanderers, we got a Night Sworn Grave Robber, and we got a Survivor Runaway. That's all we're working with here, which that Survivor Runaway's healing benefit has actually been pretty significant in this run so far. Yeah, that's about what I'm expecting, to be honest with you, Sonder. I'm thinking things are going to stop being so easy on the next passive uh, updates and fixes. Things are going a little too smoothly lately. This is a good time to use a smoke screen, but I still want to hang on to him. I want to, I want to, I want to save him for the cultist fights and being greedy here. Plus, we have taunts here. I'm sure we'll be fine. Nice combo to actually be able to stun the guy. Do do do. No, no new update after Trinkets. Just a Night Sworn Grave Robber here. That's pretty much it. Right there. Right there is where you want to punch. Give her a good old punch in the mouth. She wants it. She needs it. Yes! Fantastic. She is dazed, though. That's a little concerning, I guess. I like this idea. Gimme. Gimme. 
I really need to try to stun this dude. Um, maybe? Yeah. Wow. 26 damage from the Runaways Ransack. That is not something I ever expect. That is insane. Okay. Crit Blight to clear the dodge. Fantastic. Oh, this is bad, though. This is really bad. Fuck. Come on, don't punch her. 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 Oh, fuck. And now, the greatest test of all. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Well, she's got to survive the DOT tick. That's pretty much all it is. Come on. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. Ah! Oh my god. Just a little heart attack. I mean, the heart attacks don't exist in game, but they very much still exist in real life. And I'm still feeling that effect. You can bet your fucking bottom dollar on that. Iron Swan. Hiya. Big heal. There we go. DOT taken care of. Variable can make all the difference. Smoke screen. That's the stuff. That's the stuff. Now we're talking. Big miss. Crit response with the burn. Runaway coming up big in this entire campaign, really. She's been awesome. Steady yourself. Ow. Alright, time to stun. Or kill it. Yeah, that works too. Holy shit, runaway. She's been popping off. Past is gone. Let it die. Huh. Wonder if that's better than the additional duration. So burn chance would be really high if we were to do that. That's pretty good. pretty good I'm gonna try it I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it yeah and let's just get rid of these bobbles dude I really don't need them there we go and then we got space for some combat items let's just go ahead and slot in that salve that works I'm thinking because it's an infernal run, I'm going to prefer having the additional chance. That's how I'm seeing it right now. Pig! Holy shit. Big pig! Wow. Oh, man. That's fun, too. Oh, jeez. That is... I'm gonna, oh, oh boy, I want it. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I know 5%, but still it's fun. And that happens a lot. And 33% is a huge fucking heal. I'm doing it. Fuck it. Yeah, here we go. Dump that thing. A use for the bobbles at the very least, right? Whiskey barrel, herb. Meditative totem, maybe. Nah, probably not. Off we go. They want to go assistance encounter, huh? Okay. I guess so. Do I guess so? I guess so. Yeah, I guess so. All right. I am really liking it, Sanjali. I've been having a really good time. 
We're still in early access here, so it's still just gonna get even better. Oh, really? We tread beyond the realms of reason. You're not done yet, huh? Ordained Shambler, third of the run. Good lord. Well, here we go. Somehow still resisted the burn there, too. Taunt's not really going to matter here. Well, for him, I guess. For her. Or for these things, it's still going to matter. More blind for you. I like take aim here. I'll pirouette into a take aim grape shot. Gotta get them crits. Do, 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 do. Empowered, emboldened. Okay. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Goodbye. Hey, your friends died. What happened? That'll help. That'll get us going. Good dodge in the back, at least. Can still grape shot this. That should be nice. She's healing well. Taunts are activated. Let's go for another smoke screen in the back. Combo in the vulnerable, perhaps. Nice. Give that a lunge or maybe a poison dart. Another dodge there. Combo on the highway, man. Not too bad. Yep, third Shambler of the run. Just a random road battle one this time. Two strength tokens on the Hellion. Love to see it. Excellent work. Big crits with a big burn. That guy's nearly dead. 11 to 31. Holy fuck. Yeah, I gotta try that. 46 damage. Jesus. Wow. That's gonna set up another crit chance here, too. It does get the blade, at least. I like Iron Swan here, man. Fucking go for it. Take this dude out. Oh, he can heal off that with the combo move, huh? That's kind of interesting. Okay. Death's door for the Shambler weakened. This is no time to falter. Feeling pretty good. They did just heal twice, though, unfortunately. Goodbye, Shambler, though. All problems have their solutions. Just gotta Even deal with the, the spawn. Ones. Let's get these taunts back up. Much better for them to hit her than to hit anybody else. Trying to make that happen. Let's just do this. Further encourage that behavior. That should work. There's another crit for her. Make it two. Healing salve seems like a safe play here. Especially because I believe her healing benefit applies to that, too. What causes Shambler to appear? I believe it has to do with your torchlight. I honestly couldn't tell you exactly what it is, though. I think it has to do with your torchlight, and I think it's just like a random chance. Beyond that. Yeah, I think it has to be below 25 torch. That sounds right. Let's just make sure this dude dies to the burn. And then we got a nice raucous revelry coming here. A little crit heal. Get rid of that stress. He's burning down. And we'll get a double burn combo hit perhaps here. Or that. That's pretty good, too. Gimme that! 
My tokens. Ooh, crit strength and howling end to finish it. Love to see it. That was easy. Plus six speed. Another from beyond. I was really hoping that was a second version of that strength one or a stress one. Yeah, nothing too great besides the mastery points there. That's probably just trash, honestly. Oh, I don't need these either. I don't know why I have these still. Completely unnecessary. I mean, plus six speed is real good, but... Yeah, actually, I'm kind of tempted to take this in place of this one. Let's try it out. I'm curious. I feel like his... Him having a lot faster attacks is going to be a much bigger benefit to the additional um, damage. A much bigger, much bigger benefit than the additional damage, I mean. Yeah, that's why he was so slow. He had the minus four speed on that trinket. Looks like we got a fairly easy Even path all the way to the exit here. It's easier than holding out against it. Let's make damn sure that they we're trying to keep these relationships in good shape. Oh, speaking of which, very nice. Two facets of the same stone. Never one without the other. Hey, there we go. We got some meals out of it. A meditative totem. Sick. Got a lot of herbs. Let's see here. Let get rid of that bread probably now. Let's get rid of the book of creative insults. Mop and bucket. Nightshade concoction. Yeah, we don't need that the stuff. Destinations never in question. Only the route you take to get there. We want the oasis. The hoarder is less important, but he might have a trinket I like. That could be worth it. Unfortunately, gonna add a little stress to these two. Ooh, warhorn! The Fuck yeah! Feed themselves to the fire. Their flesh melting like candle wax. That's another one that's actually worthwhile to hold on to the, or hold on to until the very end. I think I'm going to replace... Well, hold on a second. We're going to do... Honestly, everything I've got, all these combat items I'd very much like to hang on to. It's just we're going to have to put them on people in order to save the inventory space. So let's just try not to use any of these combat items for the remainder of this region. Because I would very much like to save them for the cultist fights and for the... For the Psy. The Warhorn in particular, I would very much like to have for the Psy fight. I just rushed the Psy, Nalu. I pretty much ignore the lungs at this point. This could be a quirk. Ah, uh, it was a disease. In this world, well, it's this good food, though. This without purpose. Bozzy balls! Been surviving off gifted subs thus far, but no longer. Let's go. Hop on in. Thank you very much for the three months. Welcome in to the pile. Give him some bear hugs, please. Let's see what this hoarder has in store. Dur. For. Dur. Us. Ooh, another smoke bomb. Nice. Let's slap that on there right now. That's a fair one out of ten. Yeah, I deserve that. His stifled smirking betrays Holy a fuck. madness. Completely unnecessary. Oh, now we finally get the good stuff. Turn start, convert stealth to crit 80%. Turn end, convert speed to days 80%. Pick to the face, plus 50% damage. Okay. Okay. Sure. Because she's not really rocking anything all that interesting right now. She's got the hail draft, which is, you know, fine. I'm going to replace the recorder with that. That seems... That seems like fun. And... Yeah, I don't need this thing anymore. We we'll got a whiskey barrel. Something to ease the rigors of the road. And that'll probably do. Yeah, good enough. Cool. A simple choice. 
At least it should be. I want the loot! Give me the loot! Even if it's a road fight, I want the loot. It's gonna be worth it. That's a lot of stress though, shit. Just die? Not quite, but okay, close. Now you die. There we go. Gotta go toe-to-toe -to -toe here. In items affect stack, yeah, so that's why I've got so many restorative herbs stowed away. God, I love smokescreen. I'm so happy that's available to use in the back ranks now. It makes such a huge difference. Don't do that. I guess do that if you're going to do that, but don't do that. You know what I mean? Just in general, don't do that. Definitely looking at a raucous revelry here. Oh, shit. Never mind. God damn, dude. Helene's about to obliterate this guy. Wow, he's alive? That's insane. Okay. Fully unexpected. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Okay, come on now. Come on now, honestly. What am I to do about that? Weak hold- Fuck you, weak hold on life! What is this? The one pleasant in the extreme. Eh. This work is noble. And necessary. That was rude. It was a very rude encounter. Apparently I... I'm paying for my greed here. For my hubris. Well, all right. No hospital before the end here either, unfortunately. Bundled into this meager pile. Yeah, it's just lower death door resist, which is, you know, whatever. But obviously would rather not have it. Not worth it either. Yeah, not, not even a little bit. Because that's just a whole bunch of garbage I'm going to have to get rid of. That sucks. I guess to hang on to those, right? And then get rid of this at this point. Get rid of this at this point, maybe. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, it's the bobbles, dude. See you later, bobbles. I'm done with you. Fun while it lasted. A sanctum of tranquility awaits. Got another positive pip there. Nice. All right, more than likely the last road fight here. Oh, there's two one-stack herbs. Oh, shit. Nice. That'll help. Lethality writ large. Big howling head right here. Actually, you know what? Do this. Just be smart. Just be safe. I'm sure this will be more than enough, right? Right? Nope. Just barely not enough. There you go. Oh, I did completely forget to give Grave Robber pick to the face. Yeah, good point. I got to do that for sure. Probably even swap off Absinthe for that, considering how little she's used that. But we'll put Absinthe back on in place of Dead of Night, of course, for this, the Psy fight. Yeah, I got to try to take advantage of that, though. Nice stress heal there. That helps a bunch. Taunt is up. Hopefully get here one more stress heal here. Okay, that's fine, I guess. We'll take it. And there's going to be... Tracking shot? No, I guess just shoot him. Nothing wrong with shooting them with your gun. How's the howling end look here? Probably pretty good. 
probably not bad. Yep. And then run away with her unexpectedly high damage. Might be death's door. Nice. With the burn, with the weak, and with the dead ghoul. Just kidding, but close. Oh, huge. Clutch. Well played, team. Thank you for that. Goodbye. That could have been bad. Well, I guess it would have really only been like one stress point, right? Cook down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. Garbo Trinket. Let's make the swap real quick on the Grave Robber here. Gotta upgrade that pick to the face, too. That'd be a pretty significant upgrade for the damage there, I bet. Plus 50%, man. That is, uh, that is nice. Oasis! More mineral spring water and three positive relationship pips. Let's fucking go! Two facets of the same stone. Huge. Never one without the other. All right. End game combat items looking fantastic. Really nice find at the very end here. No extra road battle. And to be honest with you, very little desire to push this on to the end of the Guardian fight. I don't think we're going to need the mastery points, so... Yeah, we'll just call it good after one here. If you wipe, do you still lose trinkets? Well, you lose the trinkets at the end of every run, no matter what. The, uh... Whether you win or lose, the end of the run represents the loss of these characters and everything they've got going on. The only thing that uh, is persistent through runs is the meta progression, which is the, the hope. But that's more than likely going to be changed prior to the end of early access as well. Yeah, things are a lot different here in DD2. It's changed quite a bit. Man, their burn resistance is weirdly low. I guess it's because she's got that trinket more than likely. Well done. Okay. Yeah, I'm feeling very little urge to push this one to the end. Another blight might do it. Yeah, two turns, that'll work. Man, I don't think they've actually even touched us here. This is crazy. We're even gonna be able to Iron Swan the back line. Fuck yeah. Three damage, super sick. 10 damage, slightly better. How about you, what do you, what do you guys say about it? Two damage? With the Blight though, okay, that's acceptable. I'll take it. Oh, basically any of them was. We've talked about that quite a bit, and I, I'm willing to see literally any single one of them at this point. The smallest variable can make all the difference. Out of here, dude. Escape. Set me free. Let us finish this quest. Toss that. I guess I'll just toss that at this point, too, right? And even the baubles. No more baubles for bear. All done with those. Now once we've got our end game items decided, we just gotta set our combat items for the cultist fights. You're gonna be in real good shape. I'm using the infernal torch right now, Hammer, which means that the torch light stays at one permanently. It's an upgrade you can put on the stagecoach that is irremovable the after it's selected. Is the table is set. The Yo! Its favorite guest. Stewie with the clutch jinx. Deadly for Erd as well. God damn. Huge quirks here in the final inn. That is fantastic. We'll start with the whiskey barrel. Make it two. 
That was fairly unlucky, but that's okay. Here you go. Give them all the best meals. And let's see if I can maybe get rid of a negative quirk here. Weak hold on life, maybe? Yeah, that's probably the worst. Yeah, okay, fear of, fear of cosmic beings is actually pretty damn helpful, though. That's going to be good. So she is now at plus 60% healing received from skills. That is outrageous. Experience, however painful, is the greatest teacher of all. Should be able to fully upgrade here as well. If that upgraded absinthe too. And then Grape Shot. Adrenaline Rush. And Cauterize. Beautiful. Looking good. The next stop is leagues away. Plan accordingly. Wonder if there is something in the provisioners. There is a Sagir, but that's probably not the way to go. Ooh, Songbook of Amorous Ballads. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. Whiskey bottle, another meditative totem, and there are cow trips here as well, along with the a smoke bomb. Violence. Despicable and dangerous. Fantastic. Let's see here. I would very much like to try Amorous on Runaway Highwayman. That will not work. Son of a bitch. Let's see. How about... Let's do this on you. Got rid of weak hold on life. That's great. Who else is going to be then if it's not going to be you? I guess these two would work pretty well. That's good. Okay. That means they are one away from a relationship if they encounter one at... Or a positive interaction at the combat would do it. Highwayman Runaway, maybe? Sunny Disposition. Thankfully did not replace the Jinx. Her quirks are nuts. Bloodthirsty Jinx with Sunny Disposition. God damn, dude. That is awesome. Alright. I guess that's it. Last check of the Provisioner. And what you can. For wealth no longer has I'll meaning. take a clarifying poultice. If indeed it ever did. Oh, that gave her squeamish, though. That sucks. Oh, well. All right. Here we go. We're saving the Warhorn. We're saving both Mineral Spring Waters. And we're saving two salves, which means everything else is fair game. So we'll use these smoke bombs, the cow trips, and the spore grenade. Everything else we're saving. Let's do this. And let's get those bear rolls coming. Because as we all know, the stagecoach loses all power at this point and runs exclusively on the power of the bear roll emote. Let's do it. One last region to victory. Yeah, no way to get rid of that Tarantism, unfortunately, but if you're gonna have a if you gotta have a disease, you might as well have Tarantism, right? Shouldn't be too bad. We're looking for any positive interaction with the runaway here. That'll fucking work. That'll do it. Aspiration unites the hopeful. Double relationship. While the heart still beats. Desire will never die. And if we can just get one between the Highwayman Runaway, we are set. Let's do this. I have absolutely no hesitance to use these combat items in this in this fight. Spore grenade start, I like it. Let's see here. Let's go with a tracking shot. 
Make sure that Cherub's not going to be too long for this Earth. We'll add the, uh, we'll add the combo off the Iron Swan from the Hellion here, too. And then I'm expecting this guy's just going to be AoEing us to death. So we got to get some blinds on him early. That's a real bad shuffle, unfortunately, there, too. Pop a smoke bomb right away. Let's go for the blight crit combo hit. That's pretty goddamn good. And then we just got to move forward, I think. Here, we're going to save those caltrips for sure, especially with a crit. Ransack seems pretty good. That's this dude basically dead. Okay. Rock solid. Smoke screen also pretty decent here, but I like... Firestarter, I guess. I'll probably take aim as the thing, though. So, eh, you know what? Actually, I think I'm just going to do this. This should be pretty damn good. Yeah, that's nice. I feel like our trinket combination on the runaway is ultimately not really mattering at all. Like, I, you think she'd be dealing more fire damage, right? I don't know why... It's weird. Why is it not dealing more fire damage? I probably should have done a take aim there too. Do -do 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 -do. All right, he's blinded, so we've done all we can do. Sadly, he can still be a pain in the ass. Despite that, ooh, nice stress heal though. That's really good. Probably go ahead and do this too. Yeah, that's probably the best option we got. I've got a crit. Ooh, that was convenient. Thank you. I'll take it. There's the worship, right? Yeah, god damn it. Ugh. All right. Lunge is feeling good. Real good. A resounding response. All right, he's still blinded. One of these is going to miss, right? There we go. Eventually. That's for six. Yeah, no, I just I don't understand why it's not dealing more burn. Feels like it should be. Oh, well. All right. One more smoke bomb just to be safe. And then we're going to go ahead and stress heal one more time while we can. More burn. Woo, big hit. There we go. Meaty burn. Burn that meat. Weakened as well. Taunt could dodge. There's the miss. That'll do it. Clean start. Keep it moving. Keep the bear rolls coming. Off to cultist fight too. Let's do this. The loathing whispers. Onward. I'm just really looking for that runaway highwayman interaction here above all else. Yes! Ooh, we even get a vulnerable token from it. Hell yeah. Huge. Two facets of the same stone. Never one without the other. That is extraordinary. All right, go for those cherubs. Get that tracking shot. Tracking shot on the one in the back. Or maybe actually, you know what? It is better on this guy. So if we iron swan and we hit, then we get the combo afterward too, so. Probably best. The jinx hits him with a weaken. Not that that's really gonna matter all that much. I guess we could just clear the dodge that way, right? Especially because that clears the blind, too. That's pretty goddamn good. Okay, that's probably bad. Yep, that's not good. That's a problem. Uh-oh. Definitely do this. And maybe cauterize? I should probably wait to cauterize until... Until she's already taken a couple of hits. Iron Swan. Uh, uh, Caltrips, too, maybe? Uh, clears the weak, or clears the vulnerable. Not worth. Definitely use them before the end of the fight, but not in that particular instance. 
speed token here. Okay. Certainly no need to blind anymore. I guess Ransack's pretty good. Should burn him, right? Yeah, there we go. That's pretty nice. See, that was the appropriate burn that I was expecting. The six for one. I don't know why the others have been behaving Another differently. Impediment. Cleared with impunity. Ooh, we get the Dead of Night twice here, too, actually. That might just take care of it by itself. Not to mention that's going to fix it, too. Okay. Not a problem. She's going to be just fine, it turns out. Miss? Ah, God. All right. That's a shitty shuffle, too. I don't feel like I should waste caltrips on that either. I want to use those vulnerable tokens. Oh, tracking shot, I guess. No, it's not even good. I'll just take aim. A little ransack with the runaway here. Combo for the crit off the blight from poison dart is probably the way to go. Not bad. Still got a vulnerable here. Man, really unlucky with those blinds so far here. The stress has been piling up as a result, too. Let's go ahead and go for another smoke bomb. And uh, we'll maybe just cauterize this, I guess, just to be safe. Calculated generosity. What a welcome one, nonetheless. Make sure she's as near to full HP as we can get her. I'm still blinded. Hope this is enough. Oh, that is shitty. Okay. Tracking shot at least does something. Get a pretty good hit with the ransack, too. All right. Pretty good, pretty good. One last stress heal for her. Probably worth it, especially with the double blind up. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, God, man. Well, at least we get to do a revelry off that, even though it's really not that great anyway. It basically puts her right back where she was. Yeah, it's really just a point of stress gain on the grave robber there. Might as well use that at least. And go for this. Everybody at four. Yeah, that is just really not ideal. A breakthrough. He might die from this. Certainly hoping so. Ah, fuck. All right, one more blind. Come on. Man, that fucking sucks. That is so unlucky. Especially because Ravelry's on cooldown. That is just... Unfortunate. At least has been oh my god. To. Come on now. That... Okay. Super unlucky, man. All right. That's a shitty way to end that fight. Overcome even the greatest of threats. Bummer. But we move on. We bear roll on. Last check of our combat items here. Festers. Right there for you. Right there for you. Runaway is going to take the Warhorn. And you're going to have the healing salves. And away we freaking go, dude. Let's do it. Final fight of the day. The Collegianus Cathedral. Malign Temple of the Iron Crown. Oh, yeah. Good call. Yeah, we got to go ahead and swap the Dead of Night for Absinthe as well. In time for everybody's favorite part of the run. Dump everything on the side of the mountain. All right. Let's do it. Give me a uh, real quick before we start. Well, I mean, I guess we might as well let it load. Give me a quick check on our confidence level here. That's going to be a bear hero if you believe in the victory. And a bear stress if you think we're facing defeat. Or your global emote equivalent should you not be a member of the pile. Personally, I'm feeling several of these. If you were to ask me, I'm feeling like we got a, got a bear hero in the works here. Things are feeling pretty goddamn good. Let's see if we can start off with some blight. Then again, pick to the face for 6 to 15. I mean, maybe that's the way to go with her, actually. When it crits for 23, yeah, that seems like a good start. Especially with the positive relationship, Pip. All right. I don't think it's unwise 
to immediately start using these mineral spring waters to try to get our stress in a better position here. Take aim certainly seems smart, too. That's unfortunate. Okay. Speaking of mineral spring water, we're going to go ahead and pop one right there, no doubt. I like toe-to-toe -to, -toe to begin with here, too. Make sure she's getting the brunt of the offense from the side. Nice stress heal there. Honestly, we could probably just go ahead and start with Warhorn right away. That feels pretty damn good to me. A nice burn to begin with from the runaway. We definitely want to try to keep those stacked as much as possible. Nice little stress heal to boot. And the dodge in the back. Okay, good start. And there's a crit for the Hellion as well. That ought to be a real strong howling end. That should be nice. I'd love to stun him, too, if we could. I'm going to go for that for the pistol shot, for sure. Pop the crit. No, let's not waste a crit on that. It's the underling. Thank you for the three years on the pile. Welcome back in. Appreciate that. Thank you for the bear hugs. Welcome on back into the pile. 41 from the crit for the Hellion. Very nice. Another searing strike. Try to stack that burn. Very nice. A few bear hugs if you can find them, folks. Thanks for the three years, the underling. Appreciate it. Welcome on back in. Strength token on it, dude. Why not? Big shots from pick to the face. Straight up damage this time against the Psy of all things. Now that is a shitty double blind, but I suppose a couple of toe to toes will take care of that. Another crit. Jeez. She just keeps finding him. Don't waste the crit. 50 damage from two pistol shots is nothing to sneeze at, man. Another stress heal. Huge. Not the greatest pick to the face shots, but we'll take it. It's going to be another blind token for her. She might be in an adrenaline, in an adrenaline rush position soon, actually. Yet another crit, though, which I suppose is going to just make the adrenaline rush even better, isn't it? Searing strike hopefully lands the burn, not that time. Um, I still like toe to toe, I think. Actually, no, let's just do this. Crit heals for 31 off the adrenaline rush. Insane, and another crit. Just can't stop. All right, so now we can use the spring water on the grave robber here. Probably use one on himself fairly soon. Get a couple more crits in the mix. Doing fairly well halfway there. Of course, things get a lot worse in the later rounds. That's a nice little combo off the Jinx. No dodge that time, unfortunately. A weakened token on the Highwayman as well. Nice heal there for the Grave Robber. We'll keep burning, especially with the double burn damage. Yeah, that is huge. Heal salve looks good. I like a pirouette here to get the Hellion back in position. Not to mention the dodge plus on her is nice. Uh, using the crit here still seems ill-advised. I think I should take a chance on this. Huge. Massive play there for the Hellion to full heal and hit for 41. Not to mention the stress heal on both. Nice. Dodge in the back. Yet another crit. Going quite well. And just another shallow breath. Not too bad. We can manage that. I still hang on to the crit, I think. I don't want to waste it. No, I need to worry about a meltdown here, but... The slow suffering begins. I think you'll be okay. Come on, burn. Ah, shit, that sucks. Okay, Day's Grave Robber, right? So many blinds on the Hellion, Jesus. That might be a revelry at this point, to be honest. Ah, jeez, I don't know. I guess toe-to-toe -to -toe is still best. 
brilliant conclusion. Especially to clear the block plus. Full HP. Speaking of which. Bring him back up to a good situation and then let's go for that blight. Huge. Any DOT that we can get to stick is going to be extremely important now. There's the deep breath. All right. I'm getting serious. Excellent. Bravo. Obviously, we had the mineral spring water to use there, but A, he got a stress heal off that, so that works, and B, I definitely can't afford to waste the crit there. Another block, another big chunk of stress damage, though. Let's go ahead and do this. A calculated generosity. And then a probably a revelry as well, just to be really safe. Because these relationships have been critical for us, and I'd like to keep them around as long as I can here. Come on, Blight. Nice. That's really big. Now, if we can just manage to stack that burn one more time, I think we'll be in business. I think we will be all set. Okay, missed it. Oh boy, yeah, I had to expect that, right? We knew that was coming. That's why we do the revelry. Ah, it didn't matter though, damn. All right, we keep the relationships though. That was our, that was our, our fail safe there. And another deep breath, all right. He's doing okay here. He's going to spring water back up. He's just fine. Actually, I probably should have done the spring water on the runaway, I just realized. I think I have one salve left. No, I used them both. Shit. We got one spring water on the hellion. So if she acts first, we'll be okay, but I kind of doubt that's going to be the case. I think it's still worth it to do a shot just like this. Maximum damage, that's really good. Absinthe is pretty fucking good here, actually. Triple dodge plus plus speed. Oh, yeah, stiff drink. Shit, I forgot. <laughs> Completely forgot we equipped that on her. Now the DOT is gone, too. Oh, no. Hellion does get to act first here, at least, so that's pretty huge. It's the runaway off death's door. We could do this, actually. That would be... This is interesting. I'm pretty sure that's the right play, though. Death's door for the side. There's the burn, too. That's pretty big. Highwayman survives. Holy hell. I think we got it. I think we're good to go. See ya. Your fault was not in burying your fury, but in thinking they would accept such a fate. Very good, very good. Big W. Great run, man. Solid squad. That was fun. This team was way better than I thought they would be, man. This runaway was so good. For a time. How did she start dealing so much damage? What even happened? Like we weren't. We weren't building damage. Oh, she got the fucking bloodthirsty quirk, right? That's what it is. That plus 30%, man. Oh, my God. That makes such a huge difference. Yeah, that was working out really well. And then, of course, our uh, highwayman was getting a lot of damage bonuses as well. That was pretty fantastic. Yeah, that was just real, real solid across the board. This team was excellent. A lot of fun to use.